to be able to say welcome uh, to you, uh, to come to have this celebration of Roger. Uh, it's just for me to say welcome, uh, but I'm bound to forget all your, all who's here. So after me uh, comes Fabian, and then we're going to get Roy Swanson, who, uh, from the lottery, uh, to just say a few words as well. Roger was launched in uh, 1936. And it's a very special privilege uh, to uh, have the granddaughter of the builder. Jane and her husband Mike have come up. Uh, and Jane actually relaunched uh, Roger when she was rebuilt uh, 10 years ago. So thank you, Jane. But again, it's a wonderful thing uh, to have this little celebration because so many people uh, have had the thought of uh, reconstructing and rebuilding Roger and taking her forward. And I must say thank you to the various trust members of the time. We've got Tim Woodbridge somewhere down. Here's Tim. Uh, there was Chris Collins. We of course thank the lottery for giving us our uh, 60,000. It actually cost 80,000 to do. So in fact, it, we had to raise a lot of money uh, to, uh, to finish that off. What we're now starting to do is to prepare the programmes for young people to use this so not just to go voting, which is meritorious and useful and stuff, but much more importantly is to allow young people to really understand the heritage of their waterways, the challenges of using a boat, and really coming to enjoy, as we have all done, the enormous of confidence and feeling of adventure and a good environment which comes from operating both of the world. I thank you for coming to recognise this end of the first 10 years, the start of the next 10 years, during which all these things will come to fruition. Let's drink a very quick toast to the future of the Roger and other wooden working boats. The Roger. The Roger. The Roger. the Heritage Lottery Club, uh, give my congratulations uh, to the Rickmansworth Waterways Trust um, for the success of the Roger. In 1997, when HLF was just a couple of years old, and we gave you the grant of £60,000, uh, I don't think we really were sure um, that in 13 or so years later, the Roger would still be here, still doing what it's been doing so very well for these last 10 years, teaching children so much about this wonderful heritage, the British waterways and the narrow boats that ply and trade upon it. So many, many congratulations. This was one of the first ever boats that the Heritage Lottery Fund ever sponsored. We're glad that it's still here. We're glad that it continues in strength, and we wish you success for the next 10 years. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you very much.